For patients with diabetes, diabetic macular edema is one of the leading causes of vision loss. Patients with diabetes, one of the biggest reasons we see them lose vision over time is they get something called diabetic macular edema. And what that is is swelling of the uh, central part of the retina because of bad or fragile blood vessels. But the good news is that now we have very good treatment for this. And what we tell patients is that unfortunately it's not a one-time thing. We can't fix it like we can sometimes with a simple surgery, but it involves administration of medication given over a long period of time um, with injections of medication directly into the eye. So diabetic macular edema obviously is not life-threatening, but it can be vision-threatening. It's one of those things that can creep up on us because a lot of times patients can have some subtle loss of vision outside of the very central areas of the vision and they may not actually notice it until it goes directly into the center. And now we're starting to treat patients earlier and earlier so they never get to that point where they actually lose vision. And I think that's an important take home message for patients. If they have diabetes, they need to get checked on a very regular basis, whether it be once a year or every six months or every three or four months, depending on how severe their eye disease is. But just because they haven't lost vision does not mean they don't need to be seen. For those patients, again, who are starting to have problems, a lot of times we can treat them before they get to the point of actually losing vision. But then the other important thing to understand with this is once they get to that point of losing vision, it's not something that you wanna wait a long time on. Earlier treatment leads to better outcomes and it may lead to also shorter durations of treatment as well. The newest medications that we have a lot of times can uh, quote unquote turn back the clock. With these injections of medication, you look at them six months later or a year later and it actually looks like they've gone back in time. So we can reverse, to a certain extent, some of the vision loss.